palace we're after is in western Iraq. Syrian desert. There's a complication. Desert Storm. Coalition forces launched the operation two weeks ago against Saddam Hussein. They've taken out as many strategic targets from the air as possible. They haven't destroyed the palace yet, but that's about to change. British SAS forces are on the ground hunting mobile Scud launchers, and they've marked our palace for massive aerial bombing. That can't happen. We don't know what Pantheon's hiding in the bunker under the palace. If it's destroyed, we lose the trail. I reached out to an old collaborator of mine at MI6 for a favor. She pressured the SAS to delay their airstrike, but it'll come at a cost. We're gonna pose as Delta Force operatives so this Helen Park can get us to the front. Then we're gonna help the SAS clean up those scud launches. After that, the palace is ours. Now listen up! Pritchard, Skinner, clear up this rubbish and unload the trucks. Yes, sir. We're building our layup here. Your crew's not too shabby, Park. <laughs> now let's see what else they've got. This will be our base of operations for now. Here, you won the straw vote and get to carry the tack map. We've got a lot of ground to cover, so you'll find it useful. We need to neutralize three more Scud sites. Stay alert out there. You might find other things of interest as well.
Gladney's promised to help your team breach the palace if you destroy those scuds. Help him out, and we'll see if he's a man of his word. You can talk to him yourself if you'd like. He'll stay here in the layup, working logistics for the SAS. Once you're ready to head out, we'll follow your lead. Got no shortage of guns. Need something? So much interest in this palace. If it was up to me, we'd have blown it to Kingdom Come by now. The only reason it's still standing is Miss Park over there. Interesting indeed. Yeah. Just help us take out the remaining scuds and we'll help you get whatever it is you need. Not at the moment. It's too many bloody surface-to-air missiles. In fact, I just received word that some of your Delta Force friends were shot down nearby. We have our own attack helo, but it's not getting up there unless you find some way to disable the SAM sites in this region. The Iraqis have a few new encampments, likely connected to these cross-border missile strikes. Intel reports several unusual forces embedded in the camps. I'm not sure what you should expect there. You're mostly on your own there. Command's made some supply drops in the area, but we haven't had a chance to retrieve them. If you find any, they're yours. I've sent Jackal 1 for the Scuds in sectors 7, 8 and 9. The rest are yours. We put advanced scouts on the ground to find the sites, and they're still out there. If you meet any, they might have additional intel. Don't you Americans talk? Of course. But no one besides Park seems to know about your little pack. To be honest, I don't give a shit about your agenda if we can get the work done out here. Let's hope they make short work of their targets. Don't worry. If all goes according to plan, they'll be back in time to help raid the palace. That is, if you uphold your end of the deal. Best of British to you out there. We'll get going when you're all told up. Might want some of that C4. Should've tear right through a stud launcher. We've got a couple rovers available, Case. Take your pick. Case, if there's anything else you want to know about the mission, I'd speak to Gladney over there. Eyes on tangos. Haven't spotted us yet. يمكنني رؤية الهدف. تم تأمين هذه المنطقة. I'm sent to me. Take them out. marked an area of interest not far from him. Should we have a look? That'll help. We should grab any others we find. 
keep moving. Let's hit the road. Sight's crawling with hostiles. I'll be expecting this from here on out. As they should. There we go. Nothing here. Iraq is nearby. 
Shall we mosey on? Iraqis in the area. Yep. That's all. Let's move.
Looks like they've been calling in some friends. The plans are falling apart. Someone was bound to complain. Someone forgot their boat. I was wondering where I left that. Over there. That orange smoke marks a supply drop. Might be worth checking out. Iraqis, the advantage is ours. Takes care of that. Time to go. Got eyes on tangos. Haven't spotted us yet. Another Samsung. We can hit it now or later. Your call, please. Case to your left. Rocky's close by. Keep low. is nearby. There's a friendly scout in the area.
Whenever you're ready, Case, we'll head back to the layup. You can have the honor of informing Gladney in person. Gladney, we're heading back. Just getting warmed up, right? Don't wanna sleep in, cause I got something to prove I gotta take what I hate and find a- Need something? Impressive. Now that's out of the way. If you're ready to move on that palace, I'll notify my men. We go in now, we go in with what we have. You sure? I'll give the word.
must be guarding something important. You don't say. Better be it. Really make you work for it, don't they? It's worth that much. We trade it all for a WMT. We're close. as a goddamn biological weapon. And they put this in Saddam's hands, too? A sample of it, based on what I'm seeing in here. What'd you find? A disc. And some notes, all in Russian. The project's headed by Matvi Gusev. Sounds like you know him. I recognize the name. Gusev was a scientist in the Soviet Union's biological weapons program, Biopreparat. Intelligence had him fleeing Russia last year. Then he vanished. Gusev gave the Pantheon a Soviet bioweapon? No. According to this, the cradle came from somewhere else. A research facility I'm familiar with. It's American. American? All right, visiting time's over, you three. We need your help up here. Time's up. Let's move. Get what you wanted? Not exactly, but we got what we needed. Take them out! Open here! RPG is back! I'm calling people! 
Tango's incoming. Jackal 1-1, one, one. got an enemy burst to the east. Tango's on the ground approaching your position.
target is yours. Confirmed. Incoming. Enjoy the view. has a biological weapon. The papers we found in that bunker, they had a name attached. Matt V. Goosey, a Soviet weapons scientist. We think he's still in Iraq, somewhere. Adler's volunteered to stay behind and track his ass down. I'll have Felix examine the disc we found while the rest of us investigate the origin of the cradle. If Adler's right, this thing may have come from a research facility on U.S. soil. Soviet scientists and an American bioweapon. What the hell are we getting into? You've asked Sarah about this supposed research facility. She's not picking up. I told her to look into Livingston. You think something's happened to her? Perhaps it's my fault. The weight of the world on your shoulders. We know the risks. Yeah, well, this isn't exactly what I imagined. Because it's not just about you. How'd you feel about coming with me in case stay side? I'd consider it. <laughs> Felix still in the kitchen. Don't complain. We ate well while you were off wandering the desert. He should be decrypting the disc Adler found. Need whatever's on it. Hey, Chef, you cracked that disc yet? <sighs> Patience, please. Cryptography is like preparing pufferfish. Rush through it and risk losing everything. Okay. Is he planning to serve us pufferfish? You said no complaining. I did, didn't I? Let me know when we're close to leaving. For help, man. Fuck you too. Fine, have fun. Does it look like I'm having fun? No, it's that's not what I meant. You got dealt a bad hand. You're gonna get dealt bad hands, kid. With us, the stakes are high. Be honest, I don't think I could have done it. Come back home after what happened in Panama. <clears throat> Trusted anyone again. You keep believing in the ones who got your back, who go to battle for you. Adler was one of those. When those records Turned up after Panama, the wire transfers to Adler from Raul Menendez, two-bit dope slinger. I smell bullshit. Adler, turn against his brothers for cash? <laughs> Are you kidding me? Those threads he loves, they ain't cheap now. Listen, I know he can be a goddamn psychopath. I get it but he's on our side. He just got his own way of doing things. <laughs> I don't know what the rules are anymore. <laughs> You're figuring it out, kid. Handling things, making calls. I just wish I was out there kicking ass with you. Kills me to be in this thing. Hold on now, listen. You're essential, man. All right, chair or no chair. 
I know you can't get around the way you used to, but this, this is strong. Maybe you were, maybe you were Captain America before, and now, now you're like Professor X. Who? Get out of my face, man. Do me a favor and check on Felix, will you? 